right there. He's pulling drag. Wow, he's growing quite a bit. He freaked out there for a second. I didn't think he was that big and now he's just solid. I don't hate it. River Rats, it, it blows my mind how much stuff I can fit in this boat sometimes, but we got it all loaded up on the bank, found a place to camp, and we're down here pre-fishing for a tournament. And with any luck, um, I might actually get them. So let's go. All right, yeah, we're actually, we're actually gonna camp on this island, which I don't know if it doesn't feel like an island because it's so big, but you know, it's an island and I think it's cooler because it's an island. Corey and I, we've been kind of driving around looking at stuff and this looks like a good place to camp. Not too worried about sword lip and stuff for a tournament because uh, it's Monday and we don't have uh, to worry about catching them like that till Saturday. But operation number one was set up camp. Operation number two is get bait and just keep checking things out. So that's what we're going to do. This is exciting though. We're, we're like pre-fishing for the first tournament I've ever fished out of my own boat. Or at least the first boat tournament I've ever fished out of my own boat. Oh, you're just asking for it in there. I like it. Yeah, there ain't much current, so we found us a spot with some current, which I feel like's a good starting point. The catfish will let us know, because if we don't get bit, then we know. To start with, we'll put cut bait on that one. I think I'm gonna put some live bait on this one, and you got cut bait on both of yours? Yep, I got two head chunks. Okay, so I have her pretty much covered. Hey, 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 hey. Oh. Turtle. <laughs> kind of look turtley. <laughs> Oh, it's cool we got some kind of action immediately, I suppose. Not the right kind. The gig with this tournament is it's uh, pretty much all channels and flatheads. Like, no blues where we're at. And if we're gonna win, have a real possibility of winning, probably need to put at least one nice flathead in the boat. Ideal, perfect world we'd get two. Actually, a perfect world we'd get five because it's five fish limit, but It'd be nice to get one good one. The problem we're gonna run into is my boat doesn't have a live well, so we have a homemade job that, I think it'll hold a limit of channels. It definitely won't hold a limit of flatheads. So if we do get a big one, like I hope, hope we do, we're gonna have to run back and weigh them in early, which is gonna make it inefficient. It's kind of a ragtag operation. <laughs> we're gonna have a good time. At least I will. Corey might too. We'll see. Yeah, we're going to pick this bend apart, I think. Deep timber with current's a good place to start. It might not be the answer, but it's a good place to start. Oh, come on, do it. Which one? Number two again. The turtle's back. So we have food for tonight. We have food. Oh, we could make it. Yeah, we're not going to starve. We're not going to starve, but our camping experience would be significantly enhanced if we could pick up a channel cat or a small flathead, which if we can't pick up either, it's probably not looking good for tournament day either. <laughs> It'd be weird if they made it easy at the very first spot, like, oh yeah, this will work. I still like this spot a lot. feels baitless. Mm, yep, turtle got me. That dog. All right, let's move. And turn that alarm off. Well, option number one was non-successful. Nothing but turtle bites. Oh, got out of the logs at least. Yeah, them little shad I don't think are going to be the answer because every time I reel them in, they're gone. So I wonder if this might be better with better bait. You know, I guess they could have been Gary the Gar, not Tommy the Turtles. 
Well, it started with two on here, ended with one. Maybe I just need to keep putting two on. Maybe we just need to go somewhere else. How did he not stay on there? Do you see that bow down? I did. Bottom one? Who knows? Probably. Whatever. It's our first sign of life. Like real life. Not not the gar life. Right. Definitely been living the gar life so far. Well, one thing we've learned is that plan A is probably not a viable plan. I also learned that Corey's hung up on a pretty bendy branch, apparently. But we found some juice. We had a few decent takedowns, nothing crazy. And we're gonna move our camp from where it's at to uh, where we think something a little bit better. And you know, we haven't learned what to do, but we're, we're learning what not to do. So I guess there's a positive in that. So move camp, get brats on two on two, ready break. All right, lines are set, and I think it is time for brats. Yeah, we got, there's Corey's bed there. There's Corey. Fancy stuff. And I'm asleep in the boat. So we're gonna have lines spread out here. One thing, uh, we fished it earlier and didn't catch anything. You know, at least if we set up here at night, then if something's cruising, we catch them we know they're in the area somewhere so that's a perk not exact science but nothing about fishing is okay I bet these sizzle yep they sizzle just like any other bratwurst mm -hmm. maybe even more Are these cooked they don't look cooked Fully cooked. All right. If you say so. Okay. We got a skillet full of brats and can-do attitude. We'll see what comes of it. Hey, Corey. Yeah, the, the wieners are finished. Wait. The only thing that would make them better is if I would have remembered mustard. But I didn't, so this is where we're at right now. I thought it'd be good, but that's surprisingly good. All right, we are gonna sit by a campfire and by the fishing rods. Hopefully we catch something. And I'll see if we do. Is he still there? I can feel something, but I can't tell what he's doing. Is he swimming sideways or if it's another turtle just chewing on it? Whatever about yanked your fishing pole in the water definitely wasn't a turtle. No, you need a solid holder for that. Oh, there we go. What do I know? Just catch him. <laughs> it's not huge, but... Is he a reptile? We're on the board. Oh, he's a gar. Is he? I don't know. Yep. Oh. Big gar. Monstrous gar. Holy crap. <laughs> like freaky gar. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> Part dinosaur. Well, we'll try to beach him. <laughs> Holy crap. It's been a minute since I've seen a gar like that. <laughs> uh. 
<laughs> He's yours now. <laughs> Not my responsibility <laughs> anymore. Thanks, bud. He's over 40 inches. It's been a minute since I've seen a gar of that magnitude. Oh my gosh, he does look huge. <laughs> I mean, this is a impressive fight for a gar. Uh, I mean, those long noses, they don't skimp, dude. Like, short noses fight like sissies. These things fight like real fish. He almost took my red. Yeah, it was kind of awesome. All right, I'll get a picture, and then we'll set him off to continue being a dinosaur. Get him back in the water. Hold tight on them grips. That alligator might take them from you. <laughs> Holy crap. Do I dare stand in the water with this thing? Man, it's been a long time since I've seen a gar like that. That's cool. Dinosaur hunting. <laughs> Is that what we're doing? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> Apparently. You gotta start somewhere. Yeah. We have caught a fish. Just... We need ones without scales and have whiskers. No armor. <sighs> not a nibble. It's not good. It's not the end of the world, but it's not good. We need to change that. Yeah, we moved camp, been driving around, looking at a fish finder screen, putting together a milk run of spots. Gonna try not to get ran over by this tugboat up here. There's some stuff, lots of stuff, lots of fish, maybe even catfish. We will see. Oh, we might actually, oh. Do we actually have a fish? <laughs> oh. I think we're gonna have to be playing out here in the main channel, buddy. Just like everybody with a prop. No advantages. Can't tell if he's good or not yet, though. I don't think he's gonna. Oh, there's a little right. It's hard to tell on these little guys. Looks like That's dinner nice. if I ever saw one. <laughs> we will not be catching this one during the tournament. <laughs> Sweet. All right, on the rattle, in the trash pile, on the furthest one casted down. Not a tournament winner, but a dinner, a dinner winner. <laughs> All right, we're not good, but we don't completely suck, and we're going to eat pretty darn good. I, I don't know if this will be enough for both of us, but if it has to be, it will be. I'm going to... Man, I just can't get over how warm they are. They're not even warm, they're hot. It's weird. Oh, there's another one. What is going on? I think it's coincidence they didn't start even remotely biting until I ate a bratwurst. I don't think so, man. Been trying a bunch of stuff and it has been slow. Bad part is, I don't know if this is just slow fishing or if I, if I suck. You know, I haven't fished this enough to be able to tell the difference. Like. Maybe in low water conditions, this is common. Well, somebody always gets them, so it might as well be me. We're gonna keep trying different stuff. Oh my goodness, I think I have him. These are the ones that come off. <laughs> he might even be too small for catfish nuggets. <laughs> What are we looking at here? Mm, 
No, he is not too small for catfish nuggets. Get the net. This is important here. He's actually quite perfect for catfish nuggets. Hey, Corey has something to eat now. <laughs> well done, sir. Yeah. Oh, he's got the bumpies. You sure you want to eat them? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Two fish on the board. Also, two fish that will not be caught tournament day. <laughs> Dragon was real. It was fun. One real fun. <laughs> <Wasn't> real fun. <laughs> well, I think, uh, I don't know what to do next. Check out that hole. Yeah. Okay. Pull it down. That's acting kind of flatheady. And he dropped it. Well, that was almost cool. Switching things up, came out to this wing dike and fishing the top end of it and out in the elements getting blown around all over the place. But that one got hit. That one's getting hit. I'm about to throw this one out and hopefully it gets hit. Oh, there we go. Oh no. Yep. That's a nicer one, buddy. No. Even pulled a little drag. Okay. I can dig this. Stay pinned, my friend. We won't even make you fish nuggets. Yep. Put this one right in his face. We marked these fish, or what I would assume is this fish. Oh, a little flathead. I like it. I bet the other one was a little flathead too. You're lucky, dude. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> you bit at the right time. You are lucky, Oh, dude. that's funny. All right, I just rigged up a live bait. Do we stay in Sorlip anymore? Or we leave. Um. I like the ugly ones. He's a little ugly, not a big ugly. We need a big ugly. That just died. Camera just died. So it's a good time to let him go, I think. He would help tournament day a little bit. Okay. Um let's get out of here. Try another one. See if it's replica replicable. All right, I, I went to reel this pole in so we could leave, and I think we have another flathead. I don't know, man. But that's quick action after having almost no action. Might even remember to take a picture of this one. He's better, I think. Stand down, like yeah. Good one. Where are you going? <laughs> right there. He's pulling drag. Wow, he's growing quite a bit. He freaked out there for a second. I didn't think he was that big, and now he's just solid. I don't hate it. You just ran away from me. <laughs> It's like, Corey, come back. <laughs> or at least leave the net. No, I just try to decide if I need to go on the other side or not. Oh, yeah. This is a better spot. Yeah, this fish was just there. I went to lift this up. We were going to leave. Oh, yeah. Nice chan. That's the chans we need. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. All right, I'm going to lift him. You ready? Yep, right there. That's what I'm talking about. That will help on tournament day. That's what we're looking for. He might be pushing dub digits. Yep. How is he hooked? He's hooked good. Oh, he's hooked real good. Sweet. Um, well, you mess with him, we'll reel these other ones up before yep. we swore them out anymore. Sounds good. A lot of stuff is happening after nothing really happened for a long time. But we literally have three fish in like five minutes. 
We haven't had three fish in 20 hours. Wow, that's a big channel. Corey has the cutest little flat I've ever seen. Wow, that's a dandy of a channel, dude. Yeah, dude. All right, this is exactly what we're looking for. And it's cool that we found, I don't know if it's a pat or not, because we're gonna go hit another wing dike, but I'll take that, absolutely. It's the biggest channel I've caught in a while. All right, I'll get you back. I want to see you on Saturday, dude. <sighs> yep, thrash around, do what you need. It's like two-ish. Okay. Okay, down he goes into the abyss. Yeah, 157. Oh, I'm getting bit on this one. I'm trying to get untangled. <laughs> Let go of it. Flip it up. Yep. Nice. Oh gosh. I thought that might actually work. It almost worked. We're trying to not catch you guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bringing it That's your a way. Terrible problem. Here, you want your fish? I don't want to lose my gear though. He's not bad. Okay. I mean, he's he's not a, a hundred, but you'll have fun. You might as well reel him in. <laughs> so he popped it pretty hard in my hand while I was Did he really? unwrapping it. Oh. Wow. Another nice champ. Nice Another tournament winner. Another A little closer. He's a carbon copy to that other one. Yes, Just sir. a bruiser. All right. Give me some slack here. Should have reeled in faster, Corey. <laughs> I was trying. <laughs> that what, was my intent. What a problem to have. Yeah, I ain't mad about it. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one, dude. We need more of those. We also need better lighting, so stand back out here. <laughs> yep, that's tournament grade one. Nice one, man. Get your picture, and then we'll get them back. Thanks, dude. Where have you been my whole last two days of my life? Oh, that's funny. Every rod. The only one that didn't get bit was the one that I didn't get casted out. <laughs> I'm just glad we have something. Yeah. I do feel like a little bit of a bobber out here. Not my favorite place to fish. I like the little, you know, nooks and crannies, but uh, the fish do what the fish do and they don't care what I want. And hopefully they are out here too, so we can call this a pattern. I don't know. We just need to find fish, catch five, and let the chips fall where they fall. Well, we have not put together a pattern yet, but we have caught something and we have something to go off of, and we're gonna keep trying. We're gonna stick with this, and I don't know. I feel like I'm fishing a washing machine. I was really hoping we could figure out a pattern in the backwaters where having a jet would be advantageous, but we uh, we are definitely at the disadvantage fishing big water in a little water boat, but we're gonna try our best to have a good time either way, and hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did hit the like button, if you wanna see more, hit the subscribe button, but either way, appreciate the heck out of you watching. It means a ton. Hope you catch a giant.